if Africa's doing so well, why do we have so many people still being left out of the system? 70% of Africa's population is under 35. Where are the jobs going to come from? The challenges to growth are infrastructure, agriculture, and the education and skilling of our people. There is a problem of repartition of revenue. There is a problem of democracy encore, but Africa is on the right way. L'Afrique a été présentée comme un continent du désespoir. Quand l'Afrique s'éveillera, je crois qu'elle va étonner le monde. I think innovation is going to be a very important part of the Africa growth model. It is time for us to focus on entrepreneurship to really propel a large number of Africans towards prosperity. What we need to focus ourselves on is is the growth that we have being inclusive, how we distribute it. How are we going to build sustainable growth? How are we going to make this growth inclusive? And how are we going to engage and integrate the huge youth population that we have in Africa? There's 10 million young Africans entering the job market every year. And we see agriculture as the single greatest potential to create employment on the African continent. The largest shareholder, the largest private sector we have are actually farmers. Can you share with us your business models and how is that changing the face of the rural economies? Le forum nous donne l'occasion de bénéficier d'expériences d'autres pays. To be able to exchange ideas, to be able to share best practice, to be able to formulate new policies together with these great minds really means that we are owning the future and we're taking it into our hands. This is a big action-oriented brainstorm. We want to deliver results. We have been able to share what Togo is doing to improve the economic and political leadership of women if we manage to get a way to mobilize them, we can really yield some good dividends for our economy. We are planting and feeding the nation. We thank God that this year our voice is being heard on a platform. So I see many, many things happening in Ethiopia, happening in Kenya, it happening in Zambia. Good practical solution. The best thing that business can do is to invest for the long term. The opportunities are there to give us the enabling environment. Global businessmen, African businessmen and women have already made commitments to invest. If we want to be relevant long term in the world, we have to be playing a role in Africa. I've seen the political will, I've seen the total commitment of African leaders. I believe we'll take the right steps to get Africa out of our current position today. With our numbers, with our resolve, with our opportunities, Africa will rise.